Eight and a half deadly spin moves that are simple to learn. We're gonna go from beginner to advanced. First one is the protection spin. You're just gonna start with your body sideways to your defender to protect the basketball and then pull the ball back. Make sure you switch hands after you pulled the ball back. This is good for buying time on defenders that really like to poke at the basketball and pressure you. You can use this to give yourself time to set yourself up and make a quick read on your defender. If you got the spin move, you can take that. Otherwise, you can drive. I'll have a way for you to really make this unstoppable a little bit later. Next is a tight spin. This is good for getting a really quick spin move off and get your eyes back facing forward. Keep the ball close to your body. Try to keep your elbow bent throughout the entire spin move motion and then quickly turn your eyes to get them back forward. This is great for situations where the court's a little bit more crowded and say you got a defender poking at the basketball, you can quickly get past them, keep the ball protected, and then see what your next best option is. It's also good if you just want to get past a defender and there's another defender behind that first defender. Number three, the long spin. This is good for covering ground and getting downhill quickly to get to the rim fast. Main points on this are pretty much the same as the tight spin. The only difference is you'll extend that elbow near the end and take a longer step. That'll help you push the ball out more forward. Just make sure you have wide open court ahead of you. You can also go into a lot of counter moves for this that are really deadly. You can send defenders flying, break some ankles, get open shots, and a ton more. This one will take a little bit more practice to get down, especially going into those counter moves, and I'll have some treats for you for that at the end of the video. Next is the wide spin. Very similar to the long spin, but much different purposes. The only difference with this really is that you're going to push it more to the side. Again, there's a lot of nasty counter moves you can do with this, but this is great for kind of setting up a defender and getting into some open space to the side of you, and then from there you can read your option if maybe you got a wide open shot you could take that or of course you could go into more deadly moves to drive to the basket more details on that in a minute big key on this is making sure you got the space to the side of you to pull this off this is also great to use as a change of direction move when you're on the run next move we're going to get a little more advanced it's the one hand 360 basic mechanics of your spin move are going to apply here the only difference is you're going to keep the ball in one hand the entire motion and whip it all the way around this is great if you need to get past the defender and your best option is maybe to get around them on the left but then immediately after you need to get right back to the right because there's an opening this would be a good go-to it's also good if maybe there's another defender behind your defender and you want to try to split that gap in a creative way Kyrie Irving's used this a few times to destroy multiple defenders at once the half spin Kyrie Curry Kevin Durant a lot of NBA players kill defenders with this move basically you're just gonna keep the ball all in one hand pull it back pop it and then come back forward you can also go into a lot of counter moves right out of this that are absolutely nasty and deadly again more on those in a minute key point is to think whichever hands dribbling that that same side foot is like attached to the basketball on a string so that way they move in unison that'll help sell your fake and keep the ball protected the fail spin no one uses this probably more than Kyrie Irving it's a great bailout move when you're attacking to your defender and you see they cut you off you're just gonna turn your body and switch hands key point though is that that basketball ball is completely protected by your body before you make that hand switch this is very similar to the wrong way a lot of players do their spin moves that gets the ball stolen so that's why you got to make sure your body's in front of the basketball but if you get that in place you can really destroy defenders and again there's a lot of counter moves you can use with this the fake half spin you're gonna pull the ball back switch hands and then from there you can do either like a little stutter step or you can really lean into that fake to sell it but basically you want to make it seem like you might come back to the direction you just moved the ball from and and then you're going to continue almost like in that fail spin motion. Kyrie's got a lot of guys with this. Kobe used to use this. Michael Jordan would use moves like this. And you can definitely add this to your game too. It just takes a little more practice on the footwork and body control side of things. Eight and a half. Click the playlist on the top right hand corner. That's got moves you can add in as setups and counters for these.